Hi everyone, this is uh, Satish Shuli. Uh, today we are going to see a design on rapid sync tool. Thing here to be remember here is we are taking some uh, peak demand over here. Okay, first you need to calculate and what a demand and that demand has to be calculated hourly basis. Okay. And uh, why we have taken this as an uh, this one assuming an uh, uh, average uh, daily demand because see we have seen in variation demand demand right Ki, uh, with the time there will be a variation in flow so we can't design it for that flow we have to design it for an average demand okay so that is the reason why we have taken this one. Okay, you can refer in that uh, variation demand okay. so this is a problem so what it states so you have to design in approx approximate uh, dimension of a set of rapid gravity filters for treated water required to be an population of 50,000 okay you are designing uh, for a population of 50,000 the rate of supply being 180 liters per day per person. Okay. Next, it's nothing but it's in per capita demand itself. Next, the filter R. Okay, the filter R treated to work at 50,000 liters per hour. So rate of filtration here is nothing but it's in 50,000 sorry it's in 5,000 liters per hour per square meter assuming the necessary data okay so you need to based on this you need to design a rapid sand gravity filter so what are the given things they have given in population of 50,000 okay so there is a rate of uh, uh, this one uh, rate of filtration is around 5000 liters per hour okay per capita demand is around 180 liters okay per person and that is nothing but 180 liters per day per person that is per capita demand itself now we will start up with the problem so what we are going to here is we are going to write a note like key assuming assuming that the given rate of supply is an average demand and assuming that maximum da uh, daily demand is one 1.8 times okay so it is nothing but in terms of peak it goes around one uh, 1.8 times okay and average daily demand so by using this one we are going to calculate it okay so first step what we are going to do is we are going to calculate how much quantity of water is being needed per day itself okay. 50,000 so that can be calculated by population into maximum population into maximum daily rate of supply so population is nothing but it's in 50,000 and 1.8 is nothing but you have you have assumed that uh, average daily demand itself that will be 1.8 times okay so into the rate of supply so it is 180 so that has been given here okay so we'll get an value around 16.2 into 10 raised to 6 liters so that is nothing but 16.2 million liters this much of water being supplied daily this has to be converted into an hourly okay demand itself because your rate of filtration it has been given in terms of liters per hour itself okay now what we need to do so this demand divided by 24 itself okay so that will get you in terms of what six six hundred and seventy five into ten days to three liters per hour itself so you have converted this one into what an hourly basis demand now what he has said we have to take uh, filter uh, we have this already has been given like filtration rate is uh, 50, uh, 5000 liters per hour per square meter so now by using those 
two things what you are doing to do here is you are going to design an bed for filter so area of the filter bed required equals to what is nothing but it is water demand divided by rate of filtration so that is nothing but 675 into 10 raised to 3 divided by 5000 so you will get around 135 square meters so since uh, we always we are keeping we need to design two set of unit because in case of one being broke down or one being taken for uh, uh, serviceability like cleaning and all the other should run okay there should not be an interruption of uh, water supply so we need to design it for two set okay so now taking two units into into consideration what they have done is they have divided 135 divided by two so that will be around six uh, six uh, 67.5 square meters okay now by using this equation okay so l equals to 1.5 times the b okay by using this one so now uh one uh, we can we can we have rewritten that equation like 1.5 square equals to 67.5 okay so here the b uh, b square is equal to 45 b equals to 6.75 okay now you got a width you got the length okay so this is our dimensions and we have to consider it for two units okay by considering in two units okay so this is all about rapid sand filter we are going for another set of problem over here so what he has stated here is uh, design a rapid sand filter unit for 4 million liters per day of supply with all its principal components okay so what he has given he has given 4 million liters in here what we are doing here is we are assuming it okay what we are assuming in this problem here is we are assuming it 4% of the water may be required for backwash so considering that what we are doing is for calculation part total water required for per day equals to 1.04 into 4 so this will be how much 4.116 million liters per day okay again what we are considering in this problem is it is also similar to the previous one but some changes over here okay so what again what they are considering here is they are assuming 0.5 hours is the loss every day in washing so what they are thinking that is in this one you are taking out your filtration unit every day half an hour for cleaning purpose okay so rate of filtration per hour is nothing but here what will be happening is 4.16 million liters divided by 23.5 so this much amount of water filtered water is required per hour so that will be 0 0.177 million liters per hour okay now again you are calculating here length and breadth also okay so assuming the length and uh, assuming the length as 1.5 times the width of the filter bed that's p and for two bits okay so total area are provided as okay so 2 into l into p directly they have taken it okay equals to 35.4 so what is this 35.4 35.4 is nothing but the area itself so it is being calculated by by this way so it is nothing but assuming the rate of filtration is around 5000 liters per hour so we have you have seen here um, this one okay uh, so it is nothing but water uh, required uh, water uh, filtered water required per hour so that is been divided by 5000 so you'll get the total bed area so that is 35.4 meters square so you have taken this one here itself related here the breadth next you, have calc you need to calculate the length therefore length equals to what l equals to 1.5 the times the b so 1.5 into 35.43 that has been previously calculated so we will get 
so we can round up to around 5.2 okay now using that same thing the length uh, you are calculating the breadth over here so that is uh, 5.2 which has been calculated previously okay you are considering that so p equals to how much 35.4 divided by 2 into 5.2 okay so we'll get the answer like b equals to uh, 3.4 meters so this has been also adopted for two units so dimensions will be so you have in a length of 5.2 meters and the breadth of 3.4 meters okay so this is all about design of rapid sand filter okay so thank you thank you very much